common horse training mistakes, sending your horse off to a trainer. Now I see a lot of people who might start training their horse and maybe they don't find success, right? And they're having a hard time, they're struggling with their horse. In fact, a lot of times people will tell me, you know, I started training my horse and things got worse instead of getting better. So I decided to send my horse off to a trainer. Or a lot of people might say something like, you know, training a horse is dangerous. I don't have the skill set. I'm going to send my horse off to the trainer. Let me tell you, if you are looking to connect and bond with your horse in a meaningful way, sometimes training your horse or sending your horse off to the trainer, <laughs> the worst thing you can do. Don't get me wrong. While a trainer can teach your horse some really good technical things and skills, really important stuff, your trainer can never teach your horse how to bond with you. The only person that can do that is you. So just remember, it's really important that you do training and work with your horse yourself so that that horse can connect, draw in towards you, learn like what your expectations are. You guys can communicate, grow together because it's just like any other relationship, isn't it? Right? You wouldn't, uh, if you wanted to get closer to your spouse, you wouldn't send them off to a trainer to get that relationship better, would you? I'd hope not. You would do the work yourself so that the two of you could become closer together, increase your communication, and have better trust. So don't turn your horse off or don't send your horse off to a trainer if what you're looking for is to build a stronger connection and a deeper bond with your horse.